Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to a really quick little tool tip thing I wanted to show you guys. I'm not gonna do a really long intro or any of that sort of thing. Today I'm gonna show you just really quick, I'm actually shooting content for another video right now, and I'm, I've got the, the, uh, the voltage multimeter out, and I wanted to show you guys really, really quick how to test your boat, uh, boat battery with the multimeter to make sure you've got the correct voltage, what it should be at, all that good stuff. So let's just jump over to the battery, and uh, I'm gonna show you how to set this up and how to use it, okay? Let's go. All right, so step one is just configuring your multimeter properly, and it's very very, very simple. Um, basically, you want to make sure you're on the side of DC voltage. So DC is represented by this V logo. So it's V with the solid line and the dotted line. Um, not to be confused with the V with a wave. So you want DC power, which is this guy right here. Okay, so DC. And because you're testing a 12 volt battery, you want to select the voltage setting of 15 or higher. Um, now, my particular multimeter only goes to 20. So I, set, I started off at 20. It doesn't start at 15. And um, that's it, that's all really all there is to it. And some of these multimeters will say DC on it. Um, but like I said, if it doesn't say DC, that's the symbol for DC. So let's go ahead and set this down on the battery and we'll give it a try. Okay, so here we go, pretty easy to set up. Uh, we're gonna start off with black, so black gets connected to negative, so we'll put it on the negative post. And then red is gonna go to positive, and we connect it to your positive post, and there you go. I've got a 12.69. Uh, now bear in mind this battery has not been on a charger for a while. I've been doing a lot of stuff with it, but 12.69, uh, so almost 12.7, so this is a healthy battery. So that's it, that's how you check your voltage. Uh, you can use this for testing wires and all kinds of stuff. Now. Uh, before I let you go, let's just talk really quick. What's a good voltage? What battery voltage are you supposed to have? And when is it starting to be a problem? All right, so then once you've measured your voltage, the question is, what should my boat battery be? Your boat battery should be between 12.6 and 12.8. Anything below a 12.6, starts being a, a rough sign. Now, of course, this is assuming you've charged your battery. Obviously, you've gotta have your battery on a tender or a charger, so with your battery fully charged, you wanna be between 12.6 and 12.8. Uh, 12.2, your electronics on your boat, for example, like your my Garmin Echo Map, will actually start giving me a warning. Once you hit 12 volts, it actually won't even turn on at all. So if you're hitting 12.2, 12.3, 12.4, your battery is probably on the way out. Uh, if it's hitting 12.2, 12, it's probably time to change your battery. So you're always looking for a 12.6 to a 12.8. That's a healthy sign, that's a healthy, uh, healthy battery, okay? That's it, guys, that's my little quick little tool tip for today um, and of course we'll still have a regular video this is just a, a little bonus extra okay guys take it easy and don't forget like subscribe all that good stuff see you guys later peace